I hear BOOM! <laughs> just scrolling around on Fashion Nova because I have a credit. I don't know if you guys re remember when I had the um, Fashion Nova haul on my channel. I had to return the jeans and so I'm supposed to be getting myself some jeans but of course like I said I can't scroll for too long for myself. So I was like looking in the kids section right and I'm like okay let me look at some graphic tees for kids for the boys and I was like oh this is cute because I saw the, the front the front is like finesse king or whatever whatever and that doesn't seem too bad right right because this is how I shop but then I look at everything I look at everything on shirts and stuff like that because I don't want to represent anything that I'm not intentionally trying to represent so first we have the pentagram over here that you can hardly see he's got one eye closed he's got the lightning bolt okay and I'm just like this all is symbolism here I can't get my kid this so I gotta skip to the next but that's how I shop for myself for my kids for even my husband like we're not getting you're not getting a Mary with uh, stuff with bones on it you know what i'm saying because that's like the walking dead um those are mary shoes that look like the ones shoes with bones on them or stuff with it's like i'm not it's the walking dead is what that represents but um yeah i'm not getting that so on to the next i think i'm just gonna have to create some graphic tees that are cool looking that just don't have this bogus signs on them because most of the stuff be negative if you really know what you're looking at and looking for it's like negative stuff i'm a it says savage and um some of them say um they've either got some type of bones or something on them or something weird um and i'm not getting them anything with a person on them because that's idolatry so um yeah just showing you guys that look here we go here's one look at that no way no way here's another one bad broken heart like look at these negative things okay guys don't just buy your kids stuff my kid's not bad i'm not who's that I have no idea what that is. Oh, Transformers. I like Fearless. Let's see what Fearless says. Have anything on the back? I like Fearless. Okay, let's see. Anything weird? Fearless Los Angeles, California. Ooh, and ooh, I like this. Because he kills the dragon. Okay. So maybe I'll... Oh, they don't have his size. Let me see. What's up, binge bays? It's your girl, Blake, and I'm back with another video. I still haven't had my son change this thing so i'm still like this when i can be up like this this is how i would normally but i have to look down to look at myself i want myself to be right here anyways guys well, well this is behind the scenes issues what's up guys i have not really been recording i've had so much stuff to edit and right now i'm editing the artificial insemination video. So if you haven't seen that, go ahead and check it out. It's It definitely was posted before this video. So go ahead and check that out and make sure you comment down below that you did. I am enjoying editing now again. And as you guys can see, I've been like being a little extra with my editing and stuff like that. So I hope you guys are noticing and enjoying that. Anyways, guys, it is Monday, June 3rd, and your girl is back on my grind as far as what I'm putting in my body. So I did like a week of carbs, not gonna lie, and I always give myself excuses. I just need to get back on it. So last night I made vegan gyros, which some people call gyros, with roasted cauliflower and roasted chickpeas bussin okay and i made my own tzatziki sauce you can use dairy-free yogurt but i used vegan mayo and put some dill in it put some oregano in it um shred some cucumbers in that thing i put some pickle juice in there some lemon juice in there to for that little twang you know what i'm saying yeah that thing was thing in you know i put um garlic powder onion powder I think I put some, a little bit of pepper, a little bit of salt, but yeah, that's what I did with that. Let me go ahead and place my order and I will get back to you guys. Okay guys, so I placed my order, but I am determined to be healthy and I'm, I'm determined to be my higher self. Okay guys, the trash truck going past me. 
shout out to them i woke up it's monday so everybody starts stuff on mondays right guys that's usually like a new year or a new year or a new week or whatever but just start whenever you whenever you feel determined to start but always start if you stop always start because you'll get it eventually but anyways i woke up at 5 35 and i started cleaning my bathroom because this is what had happened well yesterday i was cleaning up and you know how you know how black people do we we sprinkle all the detergent and stuff so i'm spraying i'm spraying so much bleach in my bathroom that i had to open the i have a window in my bathroom i had to open the window in my bathroom open the window in my bedroom because i'm about to pass out so i sprayed all this bleach and then i sprinkled the ajax on top of the bleach let that marinate you gotta let it sit you gotta let it sit so you let it sit right and so once i was cleaning up and I already had that in the bathtub and in the toilet and in the um, sink. I was doing other things. And then I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to cook dinner. So I can't do the bathroom and then go to the grocery store and then cook dinner. Let me just let it keep sitting, let it marinate. And then I'm going to go to the grocery store and get the ingredients I need for dinner. So last night I made the vegan gyros with the roasted cauliflower and the roasted chickpeas. So I made that, ate that, okay, and was like, you know what, I'm not going to, I'm not cleaning the bathroom tonight, okay? I'm going to sleep, okay? What did I do? I actually started to edit. That's what I started to do, edit. Because when I'm not doing anything, I feel like something needs to be done. <laughs> I'm editing last night until I'm until I couldn't edit anymore. I edit until I like I'm passing out. And so I went to bed, woke up at 5:35. I'm tired right now actually, to be honest. I'm a little exhausted. Woke up at 5:35 and then I cleaned the bathroom, took a shower, started editing again, made breakfast, made lunch, and started editing again. And now I'm out getting my tea. So yeah, that's what I, oh, let me tell you while I'm editing, right? Um, around like six something this AM, I'm editing and I have a window in my room and I hear boom. And right after the big boom, all the light, all the power goes out. It just goes black immediately. So I'm like, oh wow. And then t like 10, 15 seconds later, <clears throat> is my generator it's kicking in okay this is the first time we had a power outage and my generator could kick in that was at six something this a.m the power wasn't restored until 10 this a.m but it didn't affect us so that was a good investment that was a good investment i must say so that's what's going on but oh what's going on this week i don't even know oh we did get the gig the catering gig so yeah i have a catering gig on saturday and my mother was supposed to be having something on Saturday. My catering gig, I had to drop off at 10.30 a.m. And I was going to go to the party. But my mother forgot that she... She forgot that she had other engagements. So she had to push back the party. So I'm like, okay, cool. Then Fat Vegan's open on Saturday. I'll see you guys in the next clip. All right, guys. I just picked up my, my, um, my tea at Starbucks. I'm going to stop saying Starbucks because... I just picked up my tea from the coffee house. But I remembered what I need to do today. And that is make an appointment with Alonzo's doctor for me. I want to be her new patient. And so that I can get her to refer me to a pulmonary specialist, which deals with your lungs. I've been avoiding this, but I'm just going to go ahead and go make this appointment today get that done and also for the dentist because i know i have a cavity and i need to go get it done like why wait for it to freaking get worse i don't know so and that and i'm gonna call his dentist so both of his people we're gonna do that today guys i'm gonna do it on camera so i can be accountable and actually get it done i've been putting it off for far too long that's that's probably gonna be the next clip me making my appointments so guys i decided to make a greek salad and i used the roasted cauliflower and roasted chickpeas from last night and i used the tzatziki the vegan tzatziki that i made from last night as a dressing so bomb so bomb i just walked in the house and i just put this salad together i just walked in the house and i just put this salad together didn't even take my purse off that's how hungry i was but I'm eating a salad. So after I finish eating my salad, I'm gonna make three 
doctor's appointment. Jarrell just reminded me that I have to make his appointment for the orthodontics. And then I have to make my appointment and my, uh, my doctor's appointment and my dentist appointment. So that's what you're going to see in the next scene. But right now, I'm about to crush the salad. Y'all were just about to hug. And I said, let me put it on camera and y'all stop. Let me see. Let me see y'all hug. They were just having a disagree. Oh. They were just having a disagreement, and I told them they were both right, and I said, no hug. And why aren't you hugging? I'm hugging. Jarrell's not. He's doing... <laughs> you're doing this. They're walking away. Oh, uh, wait. Can you hug with two hands? Hug. That's a one hand. Uh, okay, Jarrell, you're not hugging, though. You gotta hug each other. Okay, but what's up with the sideway thing? Okay, okay, yeah. hug. Both both, both of y'all hug front way with, hug, with, with, with both hands. <laughs> one, two, three. No. 10 seconds. <laughs> your food about to burn. Okay, get your food, girl. <laughs> okay, guys. First... I'm going to call the orthodontics appointment. Oh, they're closed. They're closed on Monday. So I'm going to have to call tomorrow. Your orthodontics is closed on Mondays. I have to, I have to do it tomorrow. Let me get all my information out. Just in case they need it. That's my gun license. This is Alonzo. This must be mine. Yes. If this is a medical emergency, please hang up and call 911 or go to your nearest emergency room. Calling to schedule an appointment? Did you know you can visit access.medstarhealth.org and schedule your next appointment online? It's easy. It's convenient. And it's available 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. If you are calling to schedule... Okay, guys. So... I am actually on their website because it disconnected and it looks like I can, it looks like I can make um, an appointment online with the doctor. So that's what I'm about to do. Putting my date of birth. Doesn't make sense now. Shit just got real, things are getting intense now. I hear you talking about we a lot or you speak French now. So I got a ticket here now I hate your hood like Who you wanna hang right now On the east side And you know I'm with the thing right now You say do I wanna watch Do I know what time it is right now It's after 2 a.m. And that's asking a lot of you characters so they want me to tell them the reason for my visit but only 40 characters okay um i'm not even gonna say i'm gonna just say check up slash pulmonary referral needed would you like to have this visit in person or via video? I mean, I can do a video. Why not? If, if it's available, like, let's do a video. August. Let's see what in person is. Is it sooner? Are you kidding me? Like, is this a joke? This can't be real. August is the soonest. This is pretty wild. Okay, so in person. I'm just going to... I'm just gonna schedule it, and then if I get something else, I'll call. So let's do on a Tuesday. My husband goes to work. Yeah, I'll do 9:50. Okay, patient Blake. But it's asking me what my sex is assigned at birth. My birth sex. Isn't this wild? The wild times. You don't ever come to me. You don't ever come to me. All she ever said is come and see me for us, come and see me for us, you'll never come to me. I'm almost done guys. 
August is wild. I'm gonna try to get in sooner. You will never come me. I've been up for two whole days thinking what I did to keep you going. I'm just entering all my information in you guys so i'm gonna turn this off real quick and i'll let you guys know when i'm done okay guys so i have made my appointment and it's in august guys which is wild um so i'm gonna try to see if i can just, i'm gonna see if i can message her i had to make a whole you know profile and stuff on the website and stuff so and i've downloaded all my cards so we're all set so let me call the dentist the dentist and see if i can make an appointment sooner than august coming through the first ones that you left me telling me what i went wrong i'll admit i'm sorry when i've been i'm truly sorry things change people change things change so.